Hi, my name is Sterling. I'm going to be your student nurse for the day. Before we get started, can I get you to identify your name and your date of birth? Olivia Raybone, 02 18 1999. Perfect. And do you know where you are? Howard College. Do you know what year it is? 2019. Perfect. I'm just going to wash my hands and provide privacy. Um, today we're just going to do a general head to toe assessment. Can you tell me a little bit about uh, why you came in today? I just have a generalized headache. Okay, so it's just general, it's not in a specific area. Okay, well we'll just look at your head to toe to see what's going on. First, I'm going to start off with your vital signs. Do you prefer what, which arm I take your blood pressure on? This one, please. And do you normally have high or low blood pressure? Uh, it's kind of low. Okay. I got 112 over 70. Looks good. Now I'm just going to take your oxygen and your pulse. Can I just have you place your finger on your thigh and keep it as still as possible? Usually perfect. Now we'll check your temperature. Ninety-eight point seven. Perfect. Now I'm just going to count these pulses and make sure that they're correct. Okay, everything looks good. So now I'm just going to start with your head, eyes, ears, nose, and throat. Do you have any issues or lesions or anything other than the headache? No. Okay, and does any of this hurt? No. Okay, your head is very healthy, so that's good. So now I'm just going to look into your ears. Do you have any ear aches or have you had a stopped up ear or anything like that? Oh, this one might be a little weird. <laughs> okay. So now I'm going to assess your cranial nerves all while doing all of this. Um, this is cranial nerve number eight, so I'm just going to have you place your hand over your ear and then I'm going to tell you three words and I want you to repeat them back to me, okay? So your ears are good. Now I'm going to move to your eyes. I'm going to be assessing cranial nerves 2, 3, 4, and 6. Um, for starters, I'm going to have you read the second line for me. 8, 7, 4. And do you wear any glasses or contacts? Okay, perfect. Now I'm going to just dim the lights and have you look straight at that clock and please do not look into the light. Now, with your eyes only, not moving your head, I want you to follow this camera. Okay. Eyes look good. 
Now I'm going to move to your nose. I'm going to assess cranial nerve number one. Can I get you to close your eyes for me and identify what you smell? Alcohol. Okay, perfect. We're doing an assessment right now. Sorry about that. <laughs> so then now I'm just going to look into your nose. Can I get you to tilt your head back for me? I'm just going to place the tip. For the other side. Awesome, that looks good. So now I'm going to assess cranial nerves number five and seven. Can I get you to raise your eyebrows for me? Now squint your eyes, puff your cheeks up like a fish, and a nice big smile. Awesome. And can I get you to clench your jaw for me? Okay. So now I'm going to pick one of the two soft or sharp, and I want you to close your eyes and identify what you feel for me, okay? Soft, sharp, sharp, soft, sharp, sharp, perfect. So now, I'm going to assess your mouth and your throat. I'm gonna do, or assess cranial nerves number nine, 10, and 12. Can I get you to open up your mouth and say ah oh, for me? Ah. Uh, okay. Yeah. And then can I get you to stick out your tongue and move it from side to side? Perfect. Now I'm going to assess cranial nerve number 11. Can I get you to shrug your shoulders for me? Now turn your head towards my hand. Other way. Perfect. Now I'm going to feel on your lymph nodes. If anything is tender, please let me know. Gonna come right behind you, and if I could have you swallow for me. Okay, I was just assessing the thyroid. So that concludes the head, eyes, ears, nose, and throat. Now I'm gonna move to your respiratory, your abdominal area, and your heart sounds. So I'm gonna start back here. Have you had any issues with breathing? I have not. Okay, I'm just gonna palpate. Actually, I'm gonna move the camera first. Can you tell me if this is tender? It's not. Perfect. And can I have you take a nice deep breath for me? Okay, your lung capacity is even. So now I'm going to listen to your lungs. What I'm going to have you do is just take a nice deep breath for, breath for me. I'm just going to come around front and do the same thing. Just take a nice deep breath. Perfect. So now I'm just going to listen to your heart sounds, but first I'm going to listen to your carotid. So can I have you tilt your head back and take a nice deep breath and then hold it for me? So now I'm just going to listen to your heart, just in a few areas, and I'm going to name them while I listen to them. This is your aortic, your pulmonic, your herb spleen, your 
I cut the I'm just gonna come right up under here and into your mind show. Okay, perfect. So now I'm gonna lay you down and I'm just gonna do the same thing. This is the JVB. Okay, I guess that's good. So I'm just gonna listen to the same areas. I'm just going to assess your arms. You don't have any elbow joint swelling or pain or stiffness. I do not. Okay, your arms are a good color. Your calf refill is good. You don't have any clubbing in your fingers, which is very good. So now I'm just going to compare your pulses. There's your brachial. Then your radial. Okay. Assess your legs. You don't have any edema or swelling. Perfect. Skin color good, normal hair growth. Now your pedal pulses. And your post tip. And your cap refill. Looks good, there's no clubbing. Okay, so now, while I'm still have you laid down, I'm gonna have you lift up your shirt and I'm gonna listen to your, listen and assess your abdomen. So first I'm going to look at the contours, good. There's no abnormal pulsations. Okay, so then now I'm gonna listen. So I'm gonna have, you, have your hands placed on the side so you can stay still. I'm going to just percuss, let me know if anything, any of this is tender. Okay, definitely good. Now I'm going to palpate lightly and let me know if any of it is tender as well. Go a little bit deeper. Okay, does that feel all good? Alrighty, I'm just gonna have you pull your shirt back down and then I can have you sit up. Okay, I'm just gonna move the camera back. So now I'm going to assess your musculoskeletal system and your reflexes. So for starters, can I get you to lift your chin up all the way back as far as you can? Okay, and now down to your chest. Perfect. Now all the way to your right as far as you can, and all the way to your left. Okay, awesome. Now I'm going to assess your arm range of motion. you to put your arms up like this and roll your wrists and can I get you to resist? Okay, perfect. Now I'm going to check your um, reflexes. I'm going to start off with your tricep. Tricep again. Down your bicep. Now I'm going to lay down to your lower extremity. 
activities. First, I'm going to set your range of motion. Can I get you to lift your legs up for me and then roll your ankles? And then I'm going to get you to push down on my feet, or push down your feet on my hands, sorry about that, and then pull up. Okay, awesome. Now I'll check your reflexes. Brace your patella. to your heelies. Okay. And your Bubinski. Okay, that all looks good. So now I'm gonna have you stand up for me. And can I get you to close your eyes first? And I'm gonna assess your movement. All right, so now you can open them. And then I'm gonna have you put your hands on your hips and do a little twist at the hips. Perfect. Now can I get you to bend over and touch your toes for me? Assess your spine. Okay, that all looks good. And now can I get you to stand up and walk towards me one foot after the other, and then I'll tell you when to turn around and go back. Okay, you can turn around and go back now. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. Okay, you may sit down. Do you have any questions for me? I do not. Okay, well that concludes our head to toe assessment for the day. Um, the doctor will be in with you shortly.